Hello and mabuhay and welcome to Ibitoy Universe And for tonight's episode, we will be featuring uh, My LEGO Custom Level 40 Mastodon from Jurassic World The Game And here's our before and after Before, after Before, after Before, after Awesome! This is Uncle Mike and this is my finished uh, level 40 Mastodon from Jurassic World The King. This is actually based off from this particular photo. Right? Cretaceous Bricks. Oh, by the way, this is Cretaceous Bricks. Um, he'll be presenting this one. Yes. And uh, based on that picture. Wow. Did you see the resemblance, guys? Yes, I'm so happy about the uh, outcome of this one. To be honest, I'm so hesitant in doing this one because it has a lot of sculpting to be made on the face. Look at the face. It's so cute. I never thought it would turn out this beautiful, right? And also, if you would um remember in our... Uh, the making a uh, video I did uh, a lot of um, revision or editing on this one especially the face or the head of course uh, this one is uh, this one I think was from the other uh, set from uh, Alan and also the um, the the trunk I just modified this one because um, I found a trunk that is so thin so I decided to just uh, do some uh, sculpting on it and also the head if you remember I used the base figure the Lego elephant I just cut it into half and then uh, make it uh, a little bit uh, wider to achieve this uh, uh, what do you call that the, this uh, thickness of the face and also the head uh, that the the ear it's only a sculpt look so cute and also the additional tusk I just got it from the uh, I think this is the tail of a uh, small raptor if I'm not mistaken and also the body I used the body of um, a giraffe I cut, it, I cut the legs because giraffe's legs is so long so but we made sure that the uh, front legs will be a little bit uh, uh, chubbier or bulkier compared to the hind legs and also we put this um, uh, uh, what do you call this a hunch on its back and we retain this um, um, studs on its back to make it uh, to have it more leg of feel in it and what else and of course the coloration I know you know how hard uh, or how much effort I put on this one this is not a regular uh, application of paint on this one because you have to paint or to put uh, the uh, the painting one by one to achieve this uh, fur like uh, or uh, yeah fur like um, detailing on this particular um, uh, figure well as for its size I think this is an okay size close to uh, accurate size of a mastodon if you would look at the um, picture over here quite an accurate super accurate 95% accurate if I may say so and I'm so happy I think and since this is my very first uh, Probocidian uh, customs ever here in this channel so I think uh, it's therefore appropriate to 
welcome all of his relatives. So, let's start welcoming our first guest. Here is the Sicilian ele dwarf elephant. Definitely, this is a lot, lot smaller compared to this one. And for me, it looks like, uh, yeah, the regular elephant that we have right now. But since this is a dwarf one, it's like a baby elephant for me. Okay. And I like the color. It's so plain. It's so cute. Why not? Very cute. Thank you, Sicilian. Up next, we have the... Charan, the Platy Belladon. Platy Belladon, characterized by um, what do you call this? Uh, the uh, what do you call the 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 tusk and the um, and the trunk is quite a little bit uh different. You would see here over here. The, the teeth is already uh, can be seen already on the tip of its mouth unlike the other elephant it's just right behind its uh, trunk over here but this one it's over here and it's so long I don't know this one doesn't have an articulation aside from the head ah, sorry it can be moved like so. For me, it's like uh, the uh, uh, for me, it's like a rhino. You know, because when the rhino open its mouth, the the teeth is can be seen or found over over its uh, jaw, like here. I don't know. It's just me, okay? Don't bash me. Anyways, this is also cute. Very bulk. But this one is bulkier. This is also... I love also the color. I hope one day I, I could do... Since we're closing to 5,000 subscribers. When I do uh, the regular painting for uh, dinosaurs or like a faunas. I hope I could do the real thing. Or the uh, actual color that's on the base picture. Thank you, Platy. Of course. Up next, we have here our beloved Mali. Mali is the uh, Asian elephant, the only elephant that we have here in the Philippines. Gone too soon. I don't know. I'm so sad about the uh, passing of uh, uh, Mali last year I think and uh hey look at the pic look at the face it's like Mali it could have been uh lived much more or much much longer compared to his age from the day uh from the day she died I don't know the the very one of the very old or the OG, one of the OG uh, Robocidian uh, customs made by Extinct Bricks. Uh, this is Woolly Mammoth. So cute and it's so massive. You know, this was part of Extinct Bricks, uh, I think. Um, if I'm not mistaken, uh, Christmas or White Christmas special, I'm not sure. <laughs> And uh, I hope uh, Extinct Bricks will create a new um, woolly mammoth. I think he has a woolly mammoth. I forgot. Oh, I am so sorry. Maybe we'll just get the... Uh... I didn't find it in the cabinet. Anyways, this is so big. I think this one is... Look at the eyes. It's not a painting. It's a stud, I think. The one that we use on the uh, Barbie dolls. So creative. The OG Probisidian. Yay! I think the video is here in this channel. So please watch it on Ibito Universe. Up next, we have the biggest mammal in the world. 
right? Extinct Rex? Yeah. Ever. Terrestrial Mammal. Terrestrial Mammal. Ever. This is, oh my gosh, let's fix the camera. This is Paleoxodon Falconeri. So definitely it's twice or thrice the size of the mastodon that I did. And the length is almost three times or four times the length. Oh my gosh, it's so big. How come? I don't know how this one reproduce. It's like a building already. So big, no? Galang. Bonga. And look at the face. So cute. Oh, diba? Love it. Thank you, uh, Palio Oxygen. Okay. Since this is Mastodon, let's welcome Mastodon from Extinct Bricks. ta -da! So this one is so also cute. This one is almost the same size as this one. But this is uh, a little bit, a very, very, uh, just a few meters or a few uh, inches uh, taller compared to this one. But it's okay. So there you go. I can't find the uh, tip of this task. I don't know, maybe we may play, misplace it somewhere but this one is also cute so mastodon mastodon um and the gang is complete so before anything else before anything else guys uh, don't forget to subscribe on this channel and uh we're a few um subscribers away from reaching 5000 so 5,000 means new franchise on our channel, so expect a uh, less colorful, less striking uh, toys or customs in my future projects on this channel. More accurate size maybe in my future uh, customs once I reach more than 5,000, which is I think less than 30 or 50 subscribers and please share it on your uh, uh, wall on your different social media platforms and also please do leave a comment on the uh, comment section below and also please join the Dynamaster Challenge every Tuesday 7.30 p.m. if you want to be like Cretaceous Bricks so I'll be announcing uh the new champion 2023 champion for dynamaster challenge i don't know if uh cretaceous bricks were able to defend his title or his crown we will see in two weeks time okay so see you there and also um if you have any other suggestions or some comments it's okay I do read them up and sometimes if you have any suggestion or some uh, constructive criticism, it's okay. Constructive criticism is different from bashing so I do read them up and I do appreciate all your support and effort. And of course, let's do some quick recap. So this is Mali, a the Asian elephant. This is Platybelodon. This is... um. The biggest one, um, Paleoxodon, the Woolly Mammoth, the uh, Mastodon, uh, the Sicilian Dwarf Elephant, and of course, my level 40, um, Mastodon from Jurassic World, the game. Yay! Oops! ta I hope you like this video, because I love this also. Look. Cretaceous can stand on its <laughs> back. <laughs> okay, so that's it. See you next week for another customs. Bye! So for now, for our Mastodon Level 40 LEGO Customs, please don't forget to subscribe also on our other channel, Extinct Breaks, our main dinosaur channel. 
uh, Tito Mike's Kitchen, our food and cooking channel, and of course, the Adventures of Mary Nasher, our pet dog channel. Until next time, bye!